M0FXB, welcome back to the channel. Your Quashang UVK6K5 can have a memory modification. We already know about the HF modifications. Now I'm on the IJV site here, so massive thank you to IJV, okay? And they show all of the details for the memory mod. You do need to buy these parts. I put the links in the description. I found one on AliExpress, and I found another one on a link that IJV has provided, which shows a nice close-up. And if we look at the photographs here, you'll see where the board needs to go. It's surrounded in yellow there, look. And we'll go to the next photograph. There's another one. Oh, and is it even possibly a video? Something there? No, but we'll just scroll through anyway I'm just looking at what else what other photographs we can look at there you go so thanks so much for providing these these links anyway so i'm just sharing information here and um if you fancy doing it i pr i've purchased uh this radio here on ebay in the uk <laughs> This one here, look, now this has everything done. You, I recommend you go for the two megabyte memory mod, and this one's got the HF as well. And this one's running the Fagi Reborn software. Um, but, um, you know, we'll try it out with lots of software. And I'll put the link in for that as well from eBay, about 80 odd pound. You'll think, well, my God, 80 odd pound for a Quashang. But remember, this does VHF, UHF, Airband, now HF, it's receive only on HF. HF bands, yeah, and it does them really well. I've just made a video with my ICOM 705. So, um, you know, you, if you love your gadgets, you're going to love having the fact that you've got one of them just sat there and it can do that and you can load firmware on. It's really important, though, whenever you load firmware, that you l teach yourself how to back up your original, you know, I don't know, the, just back it up with the original what's on it already. <laughs> <laughs> uh, why can't I even say that? So if you look here, there's um, a download for backing it up, and it, it's actually not hard to back it up. There it is there, like, there's the window for backing it up. You literally download this program called K5 program, which we will be doing, and then make a backup. You select backup. Um, so read calibration, write calibration, that's for reloading it. Read the full EEPROM, write full EEPROM. So you, you definitely, that is so important if you ever even tinker with these kind of modifications uh, especially Fagi Reborn you need a backup anyway otherwise this is about the memory channel bye for now all the best